Let's solve some problems from Siegel's biochemical calculations. Let's start with page number 92, problem 17. So the problem is uh, the weak acid HA is 2.4% dissociate in a 0.22 molar solution. 0.22 molar solution. Uh, and they then ask to calculate in, in A, the Ka, association constant, uh, P, the pH of the solution, C, the amount of uh, 0.1 normal KOH required to neutralize 550 milliliters of the weak acid solution five hundred fifty milliliters of this solution HA and the number of uh, H plus ions in 550 milliliters of the weak acid solution Okay, let's, let's do that step by step here. Start writing down the, the equation for the dissociation HA in equilibrium with H plus and A minus, a weak acid. And you know that the, the concentration was 0.22 molar. And 2.4% of that, 2.4 divided by 100, dissociated. So we have a dissociation of 0 0.0528. Okay, so we start with uh, 0.22 molar. of the acid, but 0 0.00528 dissociate. So let's write this thing down here. This, we start with 0 0.22, 0, and 0, right? Now 0 0.00528 dissociate. So subtract here 0 0.00528. And for each HA that dissociates, it's going to give one H plus and one A minus, right? So 0 0.00528 and 0 0.00528. We subtract here 0 0.02 from 0 0.00528, it gives 0 0.21472. Now we have the concentration here and the concentration there. So let's calculate the Ka. Okay, then it will be the, the concentration of uh, the proton times the concentration of uh, the A minus. So it will be the same concentration twice, so that will be 0 0.00528 squared divided by 0 0.21472, let's put this thing here, plug it in, and this is going to give as a result of that, one3 10 to the power of negative or approximately okay so that will be the answer for part a of this problem let's turn the page here and work on part b of the problem that is the ph 
we know the concentration of protons when the problem before was 0 0.00528 molar. Uh, therefore, we have a, the pH going to be z minus log of 0 0.00528 with the concentration of protons. All right, what we do here, plug in that number in the calculator, get the log, and finally, we get the pH, which should be 2.28. Let's skip in here uh, the part C for later. Let's do D first. Okay, let's go to D now. And the we have the concentration of protons is uh, 0 0.00528. And the question is that the, how many ions in 550 milliliters, that's to say 0 0.55 liters. Okay, so we have that. Molarity is equals number of moles divided by the volume in liter. So we have molarity, we have volume in liter, we can have the number of moles of H plus. So the number of moles of H plus is going to be calculated by multiply the molarity times the volume in liter. Therefore, 0 0.00528 times 0 0.55 would give you the number of moles, which is 0 0.0029. Write down here, 0 0.0029. This is the number of moles. Uh, the, the question is the number of ions. Okay. So we know that the one mole has 6.02 10 to the power of 23 ions. Therefore, we can re plug in there and replace, multiply, multiply 0 0.0029 times 602 10 to the power of 23. And that would give us 175, 1.75. 10 to the power of 21 ions, H plus. Turn the page and do the C now. We want to neutralize. So let's start in here with 550 milliliters of the HA. And then we want to neutralize that to 0 0.1 molar. KOH. Just repeating here the, the question, and the question is what the volume of this KOH would be required for that. There are various ways of solving this problem. You have to keep in mind that this is a neutralization, but both uh, are uh, monoproducast and the KOH, one unit. So uh, normally, we would use the formula N1V1 and 2V2 normality. Uh, but also, we can use M1V1, M2V2, because we have one OH and we have one hydro, uh, uh, proton for the acid, so that both formulas would apply here. Be careful when we have things like sulfuric acid and the calcium hydroxide, things like that. Okay, so plugging. 0 0.22 times 550 milliliter, right? 0 0.1 and what will be the volume of KOH? That's V2. You plug in here and you multiply 0 0.22 times 550 divided by 0 0.1. This is a simple one. Gives 1,210 milliliters. Solid hydroxide would be required. 
That's all.